Hey guys, West Coast Picks here, and today we're not going to pick this American lock. We are going to bump it open. A lot of people think that uh, you can't bump these security pinned locks, but you actually can. This is um, the bidding, as you can see, for this lock. Uh, it's fairly extreme in the beginning there. It's got a nice big deep cut and then a high one right after it. So, you know, typical typical extreme bidding there. Um, I'll show it working here. Lock works good. I bought this lock new. Um, no, don't know the date of it. UNNI3. I'll figure that one out. But it's uh, A1100 American aluminum padlock. And, uh, this is me bumping it. So, we all know this locks are full of serrated pins and stuff, right? So let's show that bump key's not going to work it. And then, uh, the key with bumping these things is it's the lightest of tension. Like, the lightest. So. go she's open I don't know how many tries that took but if you had one of the machine gun springs or whatever um, would have been a lot quicker uh, it was still way under a minute and probably under the time that most people would take to pick one of these it's full of serrated pins five of them and we're gonna take a look at this core here Bidding is not too extreme, but with bumping it doesn't really matter, right? There you go. As you can see, don't know what the date on this thing, but there is no shim in there. So, or uh, wafer, or whatever you want to call it. So that is strange. I'm just going to grab a uh, cloth here, paper towel, so I can uh, clean this core. You haven't noticed I put down some uh, white matting to I don't know not protect the the bench because it's all screwed up already, but to uh, you know provide more contrast for for the video and better lighting. Seems to be good so far. Anyway, uh, what was I looking for? Pinning tray. Sorry guys. Should have prepared for this. But Just a shelf up there where I keep uh, a bunch of stuff. Anyway, move all the way. Get the key, the real key. And start taking them out. Two went right up on pin one, of course. Uh, of course, I just put all my stuff away. <laughs> You're gonna see why I don't do this that often. I, I'm not that good at it. I don't even have the proper tools. I don't have any plug followers, so we won't be looking at the. Uh, driver pins there up in the Bible but we can look at all the key pins in this core because it's got all the holes in it Jeez, taking longer to get pins out and it does to open the lock anyway there we go guys it's empty five out of the six like normal and I don't know if you can see that but they are all serrated pins let me uh, get closer to the camera here 
don't know if you can make out the serrations, but uh, let's see if I can help you. And, oh, there we go. Serrated pins. Hey, this magnifying glass is pretty good. The lighting sucks, but maybe it works down here too. Oh, yeah, that's not bad, I guess. There you go. Serrated pins. Yeah, it doesn't work that far down. Too much light. But anyway, you can see they're all uh, they're all serrated pins. Yeah, you can kind of see anyway. I need a better webcam, guys. This is ridiculous. But you can bump these American and Avis and uh, Guard and you know all those ones that come with spools and uh, serrated pins. You can actually bump them. You just got to be very light on the tension. That's the only key. All right, guys. I'm gonna get this lock back together. Try to have a good one and uh, don't break any laws. Alright, ciao.